Well, I have to start by saying the schutzpah of Nancy Pelosi mm. coming on TV and saying, the children, the children, sure, just the Ukrainian ones? We just forget about the 13,000 ones in Gaza, presumably, please. I think, look, Navalny is a figure. He will long outlive the short but meaningful life that he had as a figure of the opposition, as a symbol of resistance to autocratic regimes, to author authoritarianism, which is creeping around the world, right? We are seeing the emergence of these strongmen regimes, not just in Russia, but now increasingly in the US. And also here in the UK, we're seeing a serious erosion of civil liberties, of people's abilities to protest. And I think that really, if there's a, a lesson to take from Navalny's death, it really is that we have to reinforce the framework of international law, which is the only framework which internationally guarantees something we can each hold each other accountable to. Without that framework, we literally have what's just happened. You don't like who's in opposition, they just disappear. It's a dangerous example to set, but it's also important that our riposte is one that highlights what we think should be the framework and not the opposite, which is the erosion of the very framework that we should be holding people to, including ourselves.